that far. Oh, wow. There you go. Oh, my gosh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> we have Ryan coming in. Unfortunately, he was just in a pretty severe head-on collision a little over a week ago with his family. Luckily, everyone's okay but his neck and back are super flared up. He's got radiating pain down both legs. So hoping we can get him some relief today. We'll do a thorough exam. Let's go see how he's doing. Just tell me a little bit about the accident. I think you said you were rear-ended and uh, they, they were going pretty fast. Uh, it was a head-on collision. Head-on collision. Yeah. yeah. I was doing 35 luckily and they're head, I was heading east and they're going west. Okay and they decided to make a turn at the last second and we went head on and she pushed me in the other lane and at my door okay pretty so bad <laughs> head on left corner uh left yeah it would be my left corner her her right bumper we connected i stopped dead and then she continued to push me all the way into a couple lanes okay your daughter was in the car and then a couple other kids yeah were in I, had, the car. I had four children my daughter her yeah. friend desiree Alex and Nathan. Good. Yeah. And tell me a little bit about, I know you mentioned that they're okay, they're sore. And yeah. They're recovering. My, my daughter's <clears throat> neck is jacked up, which I was going to talk to you about, see if we can start getting her in here. Yeah, we can do that. And her neck and her low back's bothering her. Okay. But with my prior injuries, it was like it's been intermittent with my nerve pain, but now it's been constant in both legs all the time. Ugh. Like my feet feel like batteries all the time now. Okay. Is that makes sense? Yep. It's just like a vibration, buzzing mm -hmm. feeling in my feet. And you had some chiropractic work before from that Yeah, accident? yeah. Um, <clears throat> I was seeing uh, Dr. Mooney okay. in, out of Placerville. Okay. And was that pretty helpful for the accident? It, it's amazing. Okay. Yeah. All right. And he had the laser there. That's why I was excited when you got that laser. It was good timing. I just got the setup yeah. two weeks ago. It's That's like a god thing right there. Post, yeah, right? Post yeah. car accident, anything like that. When there's acute inflammation, it's yeah. nice to have. Like, I've already done a pretty thorough exam on you initially yeah. back when I was seeing you. So we don't need to do like a super in depth one. I know you already have nerve damage that's permanent in, yeah. that, in that left side. Um, mm. So I'll just take some reflexes and um, we'll do a couple other tests and then okay. we'll get started on the treatment so you don't sure. have to be here for two hours. Okay. okay. <laughs> All right. I'm still having a hard time turning to the right. Left seems to be okay, but it hurts still going to the right. Turning right. your head. And like from the base of my skull all the way to my shoulder, this was super inflamed. It's starting to go down now, but it's still higher than the other side. Be careful on that foot. They're gonna do an X-ray on it. I'm walking on my end toe. There's a there's a huge knot on the middle of my foot. Okay. And I'm not gonna. I'm not. Yeah. Gonna <laughs> okay. Just, it will, just it will definitely them. light up if you hit that right, that spot. Your reflex? Oh no, the side of my foot. Oh no, I'm sitting right here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I've been noticing a little bit more me. shoulder pain in the right. Relax that arm for okay. me. My guess would be probably neck related. Yeah. Because you're especially having a hard time turning yeah, to the right. My left shoulder has already been injured, but this right one usually is good. Did that shoulder, it didn't take an impact, I would no. imagine, right? If, you were, if they were coming from that side. The only thing I could think of is right as we're <clears throat> about to hit, I, all I could do is hold on to this wheel and I went over to the side and I got everything this way. Like you I, was trying, I, was trying, I was trying to protect uh, Desiree. It was just a reaction. Yeah. Let me just have you, can you raise the arms up here? Pretty painful. This one's real painful, like usual, but this one's. Okay, I'm not going to force you through that. Okay. Go here for me. Can you That's a little bit better. A little bit better? Yeah. Okay, hold there for me. Don't let me pull you. It's like a bicep okay. curl. Okay. Hold there. Don't let me pull you. Okay. And then turn the hands around. Push me. Yeah, good. Push me. And then go here. Don't let me move you. Oh, that 
Something hurts. Like that day, I already have an injury there, though. Okay. Hold there. A little bit. Okay, two more. Okay. Oh, man. Just lifting up super hard. If I, if I go up more than that, I get pinch on both sides. Just bring the wrists up. Okay. Don't let me move your wrists. Yeah, my strength's okay, though. Yeah, strength's okay. Not necessarily pain I'm looking for, it's just neurological oh, okay. damage. Yeah. Okay. And then turn the wrists in, curl them up, hold there. Okay. Because you've had um, multi level fusion? Yeah, two, two tiers of my neck were fused. Okay. And I know I have a couple bulge discs above that. And we've adjusted it yeah. pretty well. Yeah, the, many... the last adjustment kind of helped with that, where I was getting kind of like a spider web feeling, kind of like over the shoulders on both sides. Okay. And it's slowly starting to go away. Okay. So it seems like chiropractors in the past won't adjust your neck and your back because of fusions, right? Right. That'd be curious. I was wondering if anybody uh, watching has had that experience. Have any of you guys had fusions, try to go to the chiropractor and get adjusted and they won't touch your neck or your back? Yeah. Let us know in the comments. Okay. Let's just see that neck range of motion. Left or right. Right there. That's where it starts really hurting going to the right. Into the shoulder or just in it's the It's like at the base of the skull and it goes down into the shoulder here. Okay. And then how about down? Right about there, that's where I feel it at the, both sides on the base of my neck. And then? Same thing, it hurts. Pretty bad. Okay. Yeah. How about tilting? Not so much that way. This side's really good. Okay. Everything's sensitive right now. Just a couple tests I need to do just for documentation purposes. Okay. I won't torture you for much longer. How was that one? It hurts. Not good? Right okay. at the base right here. Okay. And then over here. Oh, man. What's that one? That one's on the other side of the neck and into here. Okay. So nothing radiating into your shoulder blade or into your hands? No, just okay. on top of the shoulders. Let's start with the laser, because obviously this area is really inflamed and irritated, okay. and that's really non-invasive. Um, are you okay seated while I get the neck, or are you yeah, suffering? Yeah, this is fine. Okay. All right, so you've had this before. Have you had cold laser or a hot laser? Uh, I want to say it was a hot one, okay. where it felt a little warm. Yeah, you'll feel some heat. We're going to start today at 15 watts and see how you do. If, if you don't feel like you're, it's too much and we can uh, tolerate more, I'll turn it up. Yeah. Okay. Just going to go over the entire neck, all the soft tissues, try and penetrate down into the joints, calm down the joint inflammation, the nerve inflammation. Might even do some brain too, because you said you did have a concussion, right? Yeah. You imagine this feeling, it's feeling pretty good? It feels amazing. Have any of you guys that are watching had a class four laser done post car accident? If so, was it helpful? Let us know in the comments. I've been seeing you for a while, you know, for the for the low back and neck pain, you feel like the by adjustments you, have really helped you out? I mean, by you adjusting me and not being afraid to do it, my life has greatly improved. Unfortunately, we had this little recent setback, but yeah. it's where my pain is actually now manageable before our accident. Yeah, I'm not scared. I mean, those those fusions, are really solid. There's nothing that I'm gonna no. to do to break that up, you know, because my force is pretty focused and controlled. Yeah, that was my point with some of the other chiropractors. Like, it's fully solid bone, and plus it has metal plates, so I don't think it's going anywhere. And a perfect example is that you were just in a car accident. Yeah. I'm not gonna have as much force as a car hitting you. Right, that's right. That's kind of always yeah. been my argument. That's what it's the, like if a car accident isn't going to break up your fusions, my hands aren't going to do that. Yeah, that's it's what the, that strong. the sheriff said that with me going 35, them going 45, 50, it's like hitting a tree at 80 miles an hour. So, oh, jeez. Yeah. How's that feeling on your head? That feels great. So I won't be able to go 
over the tattoos, but I'll be able to go, I'll be able to work around it. Okay. Because that'll superheat your ink and burn you. Okay. If I push you there, how you doing? Yeah, that hurts a little. Super painful? Okay. Wow, that fight's worse. Okay. I'm going to go real gentle, just checking out the tone of the soft tissues. That feels really good. Okay, good. I feel like it's not like that vibrating feeling that you get. I don't know if you can understand that, but... It's like it's buzzing. You know? Yeah. I tell some people it feels like the, it's like vibrating their cells. I'll adjust you here in a second. Okay. How are you doing? Oh, my gosh. Any different? That's, that's way better. Way better? Yeah. That's just weird how that works. It's kind of crazy, right? It is. I was a non-believer for a long time, and then right. I saw enough people get help from it, saw enough data, talked to enough people. I'm like, all right, I need to get one. Well, that's what I thought when my other chiropractor in California brought that laser out after the accident. I go, no, I need to be adjusted, not a laser. And he goes, trust me. Because <laughs> you were skeptical yeah, too. Yeah, and it, yeah. It, I'd probably healed in half the time that I probably would if I didn't get the laser. Doing okay? Yeah. Just giving the dragon a little bit of love, so it doesn't get too angry when hey, we adjust I'll you. I'll take a free massage any day. <laughs> it's kind of right in that same yeah. spot, right mm -hmm. through that TL junction here. We'll see if we'll get that to move for sure. And then chin down just a tad. Is that pretty painful? Yeah, my neck is moving down better too. Okay. Let's go, yeah, hands on top of mine. Big breath. Hand out. Oh. <sighs> I love that one. <laughs> That's been moving nice on yeah. you. Slowly here. I've been wanting to check out Instagram. I don't have an Instagram account, so. No? Now that you're on Instagram, we gotta check it out. Yeah, check it out, man. <laughs> We're getting the YouTubes going. Make sure to subscribe. All right, we're just gonna try and open all this up all the way to that TL junction. So I'm gonna roll you a little bit. Back okay? Yeah. And then I'm gonna push up, squeeze me a little. Oh my gosh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that was good. That's what we were looking I for. I knew it was bound up. Man, that was great. That's the best it ever moved. Nice work. Not too painful? No. I think that's kind of what the laser is nice for, because usually you're pretty protective after a car accident. Yeah. But it seemed to calm things down yeah, a little bit. Yeah, because our, our last adjustment, it didn't seem like it was moving too well. But man, that laser. Okay. I'm sold. I'm a believer. I'm a believer myself. now. I know, I'm a believer now. Breath in and out. Oh, wow. Man. That, man, that really moved it today. I know, your back's performing for the camera. <laughs> uh, slide up a little bit. There you go. Man. That's good. Okay. Big breath. Just let everything go real loose. There we go. Okay. Good. See if we can get moving here in the mid-back. Thoracic spine first. So take a little breath and let it go. Doing all right there? Yep. Okay. Good. Got that one. Yeah. That buzzing in my feet is not as bad now. After the adjustment? Yeah, that was, that was like instant relief. Good. I'm hoping we can get some really good movement in here today for you. Alright, I'm going to try and get C1, C2. So I'm going to bring it up and over. Let the head fall. Oh, wow. Perfect. <laughs> Painful at all? No. I think there's just that nervousness right before you do it. 
but once you relax and let you do your job, it's like... I mean, I understand. It's your head. Yeah. Precious cargo on board. A little further. Alright. Real heavy with the head. Oh. Yes. <laughs> That's what the doctor needed right there. That's what the doctor <laughs> ordered. Okay. Doing the strap today? Yes, sir. Okay. Let me just, uh, let me do a couple stretches with you, and then I just want to see how it feels. Because yeah. if I give you that traction and your body doesn't like it, we, we might just wait a week. Okay. You know what I mean? Post-car accident. But yeah. traditionally, you've responded really well. <laughs> Is this your favorite adjustment, though? Yes, yeah, one of my favorites. Yeah, my neck feels a lot better. Already doing better? Yeah. It's not, it doesn't hurt to move up like that. Let's do a couple stretches and I'm just gonna check in with you, okay? Okay. How's that? That feels good. Okay. I'm gonna take you a little further. How's that? Good. Okay. I'm gonna take you all the way with just a stretch. What do you think? How's that end point? That feels great. Okay. How's that? That feels good. Okay. I'm going to take you a little further. How's that? Good. Okay. I'm going to take you all the way with just a stretch. What do you think? How's that end point? That feels great. Okay. Feel like you're able to relax okay? Mm hmm All right. Let it go. Ah, oh, there we go. Up. The other part that didn't go out, that, that went. Oh, down in the mid-back? Yeah, all the way down to my mid-back. Oh. How'd that one feel? Amazing. Good. Any pain with that? I was a little concerned. No, no. Just, just a little bit on the stretch part. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Whew. That could all light it, but man, that feels great. <laughs> yeah, I know we got a little work to do, but that was a good start. I'm turning my head a little bit more now, dude. Yeah, come back around. Let's just kind of see. Yeah, that is. Yeah. How are you doing looking left and right? Not quite all the way to the left still, or the right, but that's where it kind of wants to stop right there. You got about 45 degrees. But it doesn't, it doesn't, like, it was like hurting, like, right about there. Yeah. I don't feel that pinch anymore. Good. How are you doing looking at me? Good. Good? Yeah, that felt really good, man. All right. Right there, a lot better than I was. I love you, dude. Love you, too. <laughs>